Hello everyone, welcome to another video with me. And today, our video is going to be about this beautiful bag, this beautiful Gucci Neo Vintage Gigi Supreme Messenger bag. And what would fit in it. So, if you like these videos, just keep on watching. Okay, so, before we actually start putting things in the bag, I kind of wanted to go over the bag with you. So, it's right here. Um, it has like little letters, the Gucci, and then this is brass right here. Okay, also the handles or the straps. Like this, also brass, and then they, they're like clips. Attach, deattach, we have Gucci on each side, like that, and then I'm gonna go ahead. And on the zipper right here, it just has this leather, it's beautiful yellow. Um, when you open it, pretty much just um, a cloth material. And then you have this right here, it says Gucci. Made in Italy. And then this is the number for it. And then there's like a pocket right there. So, um, before we actually put anything in the bag, um, the measurements from here to here is 9.5 inches, okay? And from right here to right here is six inches. And then it is three inches um, as far as depth. So, wanted to let you know the measurements and we're gonna go ahead and get started. Okay, so we do have a few items over here that we're gonna go ahead and try out, but I will explain first what items we have, okay? So we'll go ahead and start with this pile right here. This right here is the Louis Vuitton Coupe in the Damier Azor print. Okay, so we have this little item right here. And then we have the Rosalie coin purse by Louis Vuitton as well. Okay. And we have right here the mini pochette by Louis Vuitton. And I do have the cosmetic pouch in the PM size, which is the small size. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm not really sure if you're familiar, but this is by the brand Stony Clover Lane. And this is the mini pouch, and I have literally just a bunch of inish, like, just electronics that I really need when I'm out and about. Okay. And this right here is part of the trifecta uh, piece. This is like a small piece. This is. Um, real leather and it's by the Limea brand if um, any of you heard of the Sensible Mama. Um, Amber is the owner. I absolutely love her. I love her products. Um, I love this thing. Um, it's compact but it you know carries a whole lot. So this is one of the items that I have and then this right here is Tokidoki and Jujube collab. This is um, from the B set. Basically, there's like three different sizes. This is the smallest size. I keep um, just medical essentials, band-aids, stuff like that, which we will open in a little bit, but I have that. And I have a little box right here I wanted to try out. This is where I keep like my daily pills, but I still have to refill those. So I need to have these with me when I'm out and about. I wanted to try that 
that one too. And I have right here my YSL um, key case. And my YSL um, card case as well. So we're gonna go ahead and try those. And since we're in a pandemic, um, I wanted, well, I also like to keep um, just wipes like this with me when I'm out and about. Sanitizers and all of that, you know, like everyone else. Um, I wanted to try this big size. Well, it's it's really like a travel pack, but it's really long. So I wanted to see if that would fit. And I also have this one. This one's pretty much like, almost empty. I think I have maybe one. But I wanted to try the like size-wise if I wanted to actually take this out with me in the bag. So I um, gotta try it. And of course, a mask. So let's get. Oh no no no! Wait wait! <laughs> I forgot one more thing. Um, this right here is um, my agenda, the PM size, the smallest size they have, also by Louis Vuitton. I absolutely have to have this with me at all times. So we're going to go ahead and give this one a try, see you know, what kind of small leather good would fit in this bag. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first we're gonna try each item and see whether it even fits or not. So we're gonna start left to right. So we'll go ahead and start with the um, makeup pouch. And we're gonna put it in. And as you see, you do have room. So it does fit. Um, I wouldn't necessarily put it in it because it just needs a whole lot of space and defeats the purpose, but it does fit if you wanted to know. So, I mean, you can either put, you can put a cell phone here. Mm. Let's try. Let's say you have your key clay. You want to go ahead and put it. We'll put it in the way back so we have more space. There we go. And we'll go ahead and put the lead. Thank you. Just gonna put it vertically like that. And what else? Let's see if the agenda is gonna fit as well. Like when they're all on there. Wow, they did. <laughs> okay, so um basically that's it because now you close it, it is pretty much stuffed. So, these, all of these fit. So, that's excellent. There. And there we go. And then we're gonna go ahead and try this right here. this and then we're gonna try all these other ones right there. Yeah see that I wouldn't recommend putting both of these together. I can put like the small piece set right here and then you can easily put these like that. trying to give you an idea of like how much it would fit which is a lot but we're gonna go ahead and put all of these back so pretty much all of these would fit comfortably no problem but now we are gonna put them together as if you know we're just going out so let's go ahead and try one thing at a time since the cosmetic pouch is going to be a little bit too much in the bag, um, I've decided that I'm going to use my mini pochette right here 
and put just a few items, essential items that I need in my purse and put it in because it is, it is much slim. Like here's the mini pochette and here's the pouch. And yeah, you guys can pretty much tell the difference. It's way bigger. So, we will improvise. Okay. Sorry guys, bear with me. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead, gotta have gum. Okay, um, I do need my lipstick. So I usually have a lipstick, I don't have a lot. So this right here is by Valentino and absolutely, I just love this. This right here, you can actually purchase it and then like a refill. You can get whatever color you want and then just boom, you have it. And um, I got this from Bloomingdale's and they initial it for you, which is pretty cool. So I usually have a lipstick. Um, this one is a NARS that I really love. Um, just all NARS product is amazing. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put the NARS one because it's smaller. Um, do you need my inhaler? with me. So I'm going to go ahead and put that. This is a tape measure um, I found on Amazon which I thought was pretty cool. Um, I do need this. My bag clip. Um, I got it off Amazon. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in there. And then okay, so let's put a little bit of feminine product. those definitely and then we'll put one of these like to go wipes just in case and then I always keep one of these right here um, the makeup remover like a travel size and then this right here is I got from like my points um, on Sephora at Sephora sorry and this is like the travel size um, mascara by Anastasia so I keep it always I kind of like little things like that and then you know just um, hairpins and Bath and Body Works Thousand Wishes like hand cream so I think I think that should be good That's pretty much essential essentials that I need. So, we are going to put these in here. So you have a lot of room. So, right now, we do have um, our little like makeup bag slash essential bag. And actually, no, I forgot. <laughs> My little um, perfume. I need that. I always need a little perfume. So, okay. so we're good. Now we're back. Okay. Now we need a wallet. So we're going to go ahead with the YSL right here, the card case. And we're going to go ahead and put that, slide that back there in the back pocket. And fits in the back pocket like so and then the keys of course so we're gonna push this right there and then put my keys on the side and I'm gonna need a little um hand sanitizer and mask so we're gonna put my mask in there and then hand sanitizer My little pill box. So we're gonna do that, and here is one way to take it out. Okay, so here's another way um, I could fill the bag. Now I do have a toddler. 
she just turned two. Mm -hmm. So, brand new child note with me. Um, I always like to bring this or something that's similar to it. Um, it carries like just first aid kit. Um, inhaler, a little Tylenol, gel container, and then I have these travel size boogie wipes for her or wh whomever needs them. And then I have uh, this Neosporine uh, to go spray. And then this right here is a Benadryl itch release stick. This is amazing. If you ever get um, bit by like a mosquito, any type of bug, this just relieves it right then and there. And then here's what I have. It's just a cleansing wipe. And then a few band-aids from the Willow Kit. So, I like to be prepared. Um, so, this is what I have in here. So, I like to keep these with me. It could either be in this small pouch, any, any small pouch, just so I know. Oh, okay, so that's like the medical kit. I got it. So, we have that. We can just place in the bag right here. You can actually put it vertically if you wanted to. And then we're going to go ahead and just pack it as if, you know, I am going really quick to the store and I have her with me. So you have um, the card case, the key case, which I can put vertically as well. Okay. And then we're going to put hand sanitizer because we have to have that face mask of some sort. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put this in there because if I need to write something, you know, which I tend to always do. So, this is pretty much the layout, as you can see. You can literally throw a few more things on top, but I don't wanna overstuff it, so. Kind of how it looks. I'm gonna go ahead and take the strap off for now. And then we'll attach it later so it's easier for me to show you. So here you go, and let's go on to our next one. Okay, so this one is probably <laughs> like my favorite way to pack it. Um, so we're gonna pack it looking cute. Now, what I mean about that is that. You know, as if I'm going out with my girlfriends at night or anything like that. Um, this is kind of how I would pack it or what I would take. So, um, we're gonna go ahead and add the mini pochette that has all of our beauty products. And then our little mini wallet, key case, and then Grabbing just my AirPods, and then I can just go ahead and stick them back there. And of course, backup <laughs> um, battery, because we always need a charger when we're out, and we never have that. So instead of like grabbing chargers and stuff, I find this just more convenient. So this is probably what I would do. Now, if I wanted to like match match, um, I would, instead of using this, I would use my Rosalie. I'd just stuff whatever's in there over here and it fits perfectly fine. And then instead of the key case, I would just use my key case. And then, ta-da, And then if I need to like run to the restroom, while I'm out, I can just leave my purse and then just take this. And I have everything I need in there instead of taking my whole entire bag. But that's kind of how I would do it. And then if I really wanted to match, I'm gonna go ahead and try if this actually fits in there. It should, yes, it does. So really you can, I mean, you can see right here. It's a lot. It's a lot, but it's just fine. 
Ta-da. <laughs> I love this setup the most, honestly. If I don't need my agenda, I'm good. If I need it, I'm still good. But this literally has everything. All of your makeup essentials, battery, AirPods, wallet, keys, every single thing in this little bag. This thing amazes me and it's not heavy. Like alone, it's less than a pound. So that's great. It's obviously because of it's mostly canvas. This is the leather part, but this is mostly canvas, which helps. And I've had this bag for a year now and it is literally in great condition. Now, when I don't wear it, I store it properly. So does it have a scratch? Does it have a stain? Everything is in great condition. I love this bag. This is like an everyday bag. I would highly, highly recommend this bag, 100%. So we're gonna go ahead and try one more way um, before I tell you goodbye. And whoop. Okay, so let's say you don't have um, a Louis Vuitton mini pochette. You don't have an agenda, you don't have anything. But you do have items that are very similar in like measurements, okay? Um, again, I don't just necessarily put these videos to show off all of this, but to more like the, you know, just give you more information. What if you do have these items and you do want to purchase this bag, um, but you don't know if it, if it fits in it or not? So this kind of helps. I do have different items like, like this right here. This the small B set piece. I absolutely love this thing. I'm so obsessed with this print that I purchased like the whole B set, Be Quick. Um, moms, if you're familiar with Jujube and Tokidoki, you would know what I'm talking about. These things are amazing. Even if you're not a mom, they're amazing like for organizing um, your makeup, um, your artwork, your pens, anything. Honestly, these things are great and they're nylon, and they're just so easy to clean, and they're so compact, and you know, I just like looking at them, so I like putting things like this. So, I mean, look at the size of these two. Pretty close. This is a little smaller, but you know, pretty close. It, you get the same thing. So, um, we're gonna go ahead and try to see. Right here, I'm not gonna be using this. I'm gonna go ahead and place these items in the small trifecta piece from the Lime Me brand, okay? So let's say you have this, but you don't have the mini pochette and you wanna see, okay, but is it gonna fit all this? So we're gonna go ahead and transfer products from here to here and see if it fits in the purse, which 100% it will, but just to show you, so I'm going to place it right here, and then we're going to go ahead and put all of these items in here. As a mom, I like to be prepared <laughs> for anything, for anything. Like, I have, what is this? This is like a, the smallest, like, floss you will find. But I like to be, be prepared and use it for me or my new children. So, thank you very much. Now, Items. So we have all of this and it's in. So, so we have this. We're gonna go ahead and place it in the bag. So have that. Now this we already um, talked about how it has like the medical kit. So we have these. You have your essentials. Okay. Um we're gonna go ahead and add these uh, Clorox, Clorox disinfecting wipes. Uh, these are like 20 wipes, like a 20 pack. So, this is kind of how it looks. So, let's say you wanted to do that and then um, add your roll. Okay, so we can have this. You can use this as a wallet. So you would put like cards, cash in there, okay, and then you would attach your keys, 
or anything, any similar item to this would work, okay? And then I'm gonna go ahead and move them out. You're gonna go ahead and put them in. And it fits nice right there. And we're gonna go ahead and put our mask, okay? And sanitizer. So we're gonna add that too. And you're good. So, again, this bag carries so much for such a little bag. And itself is not heavy. It's actually very super light. And I've been loving like lighter bags because, you know, after a baby, you kind of just don't want to carry anything. So this right here, hands-free, you have a lot of things, your essentials go in it and it carries a lot as you can see so um hope you guys like this video as much as i loved talking about these items uh if you do have any questions go ahead and um, put them in the comments or my instagram if you guys want a certain bag or have a question about any of these items that you want a different video on let me know and i will be glad to share them so um if you like this video again, so give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. Till next time. Bye!